Yo, what's going on guys? Talia Jungle is a long lost relic. People don't really play her even though she has some of the highest mobility, CC, and damage in the game. It's mainly because she's heavy skill shot. The main thing you need to know is on a heavy skill shot champion, as long as you come in deep behind them on the gank, you can pressure with autos, throw out your less, your lowest cooldown abilities first, and save your important stuff like our knock until after they flash. It's that simple. We have Dark Harvest, Cheap Shot, Eyeball with Treasure Hunter, Free Boots, Cosmic with WP and Health. We're already moving 363 just from passive. That's already faster than having boots. Very happy with that. I'm going to path towards my bot side. It's going to be fun, fun, fun. We'll go Q into E, Max Q first, E second, and W last. Talia does have some bonus damage against monsters to help her jungle. For our build, we are going for the uh, Luden's Companion into a shadow flame into a robadon ludens is really really good on talia for the movement speed you always want to queue off your worked ground it's empowered it stuns monsters as well it's pretty broken auto queue always queue off your worked ground we need to get back into here for a second we queue off the work ground we could have should have would have smited the blue buff that would have been a bit better Hit level too fast, or we just had it at a weird HP spot. Pull him to our work ground, and then we can AoE it just like so. Get that big fat AoE stun. That's a big reason why Talia farms so healthy, honestly. Is the stun. Boop. We'll go ahead and get a point in our W so we can launch it through the E, maximize damage. Boop. The most important one that get hits is the, the big one, honestly. Small ones don't matter that much. And we'll queue from here. It is good to queue from your work ground, but if you're going to have to go super far backwards to get to it, it may not be worth it. Get that one raptor spot. Get with the EW. Oof. Queue from that work ground. We get the lower cooldown, higher damage, it plus stun. And you're going completely leashless with not a fully optimized clear. We were comfortably able to do a 314, and I am not a Talia one trick. 314, bull health, no potion, no leash. Talia is a 100% le legitimate jungle pick. I feel like part of it is she's expensive. She is not cheap to get your hands on. Boop. I kind of want to wait for my EW. I'll step up here. We'll pressure him with our EQ. Get the W. Wait, he still had flash? R, you died. He still had flash. What are you doing, my man? All right, Ramus. R is just not going to come. We'll get him with the W back in the E. Get this done. R is saving charm for next game. Is she? Auto into Q. All right, we'll take it. We'll take it. I want to play around. Oof. Bro, I cannot move. Oof. Got the knockback. It's kind of an awkward knock. I probably should have knocked her into me. To be fair. Got him. Red buff auto onto Brand. I have to path back a bit. I can get to this, though. Looking with the WE. There's the stun. Ooh, we'll take it, we'll take it, we'll take it. Ha ha ha, let's go. The range on W is vicious. And while they're in midair, you can get down your E and it will still count the stun. So uh, you don't have the EW. It's generally best to do that because you can apply the slow from the E to help you land the W. But you can just raw W and then get the E down midair. All right, let's get as much of Luden's companion as we can. The mana part is honestly not important. As a jungler, mana is almost never an issue. The only jungler who it can be on is Karthus because his E uses a stupid amount of mana. It makes no sense per second. Other than that, though, the jungle item is constantly pumping you full of mana. So, so yeah, we're going to focus down Hextech Alteration first. Get Ludens into a Shadow Flame. 
Worst champions to play Tali against are assassins that can go through your nonsense. Zed blinks. Zed has two blinks that your E doesn't interact with. Any dash or leap, you'll stun them with your E if they just try to jump through or anything like that. So yeah, blinks. Zed blinks really hard to, to deal with. Uh, Talon's tricky, lots of burst. Rengar's tricky, lots of burst. But Zed is the worst by far because he's got two blinks, so you can't really do anything with your W or your E against him consistently. Yikes. I goofed that hard. Boop. I'll full clear in the ball. I'll do Krugs here and then King fought after they come back. Got the AoE hit. The small one was too far in front, so he completely blocked it. I doubt they've had time to ward up here. They just got back to lane. It's usually a pretty good time to gank. Ooh, Brand. All right, get down the Q. All right, I need to get a Dark Heart or Dark Seal. They're on me right now. She stunned herself by jumping through it. Ah, uh, I'm actually just dead though. Yeah, she ghosted for it. She got the shutdown. Or, yeah, she ghosted. I don't think she flashed. But hey, I got Luden's now. Even if I don't have a Dark Seal or whatever. Tlee's a scary character. Might be able to gank top with Luden's. We can do a lot. And we're moving 363. We don't have to invest into early boots. We get to get away with going free boots. Stack it up fast. I'm about to hit six. I think it's worth doing this, even though I just missed my W rip. Auto Q. We're gonna try to get close so we can R her. And I uh, should be able to get it right there. We have to double click R. EW, goodbye, Alawi. So now she has a really delayed back. And uh, yeah, good. Good for our top laner. I have my free boots as well. I should probably invade his jungle. <coughs> I'm really, really fed. I see Brand's getting pushed away as well. I already know their top laner is going to be slowly coming back to top. Yeah, Tlee takes stuff pretty quick. We're going to spam him out with Qs. Got him with Empowered Q. Get him with EW. Our damage is stupid high right now. <laughs> Our damage is so freaking high. <laughs> Brand said jungle gap in all chat. What a turd. I mean, what is Ramus supposed to do? This is a hard matchup for Ramus. I'm a mobile AP champion. I don't really need autos either. Everything about us counters him. I'm going to path over to his bot side camp. I don't have R to escape, but I do have ghost. I'm moving on walls. 402 movement speed. Good lord. We're fast. Most champions tier 2 boots move 380. We're faster than tier 2 boot champs. Not even buying, buying boots. Get with the EW. I don't think I can actually kill Lau here. She's awkwardly tanky. She's gonna kill my soul? Wow, she actually killed my soul there. She's spamming out this nonsense on me. Hmm. Run her down. She's dude, why do these people always have flash? After they kill my teammates, it makes no sense. And I'm gonna die now. Oh my gosh, I didn't even see Ramus. I tunneled so hard. Kled's gonna die for it. Very cool. 10 out of 10. Nice. Well played, Kled. I am not coming anywhere remotely close back to your lane. I need to just get my Dark Soul full stacked. I can carry this game. I, I, oh, that, that really frustrates me though. When laners die solo, it's like it is what it is. But they die and the opponents still have their flash. It's like, what are you doing? Nice.
I slux got him. I need to keep my dark still stacks up. That's how we're going to win this game. Also farming a lot without dying. Hmm. Ramus Raptors are back up. I could head over bot side with my R. What is Braum doing here? Got red buff slow on him. Got the EW. Oh, man. I honestly don't know if Ari could do any less there. I just don't understand how we don't get a kill on that. We landed everything. That sucks. I gotta play around my bot lane. I've already been playing around mid and top and seeing what they have to offer. Lowy full health. Yeah, I'm not going there. Also, how does Nyla keep roaming on me? She's just roaming for free. Their AD carry is the person who's killing me. Like two of my deaths are from Nyla just running me down. Nice. I'm coming. I'm going to double tap R. And I run her down. Dark Harvest stack. I do enjoy some farm. Auto Q auto. All right, I'm on my way for Brom. I can kill him here. I'll pinch him from behind. I might be on a ward though. Nyla is about to pinch me. I can tell. Oh, yeah, I got the knock on him. Got it. Oh, what's that, Nyla? You died? Ha <laughs> ha ha! That was a solo 1v2, technically, because they didn't take damage from another source there. At least according to the game. Having ghosts is so much fun. Just ghosting people down and beating them with your rocks. I want dragon. Draxol win con. They might fall for it, but I, the thing is I want Dragon. I don't need more kills right now. They may or may not come back to lane since they lost turret. They may or may not step up. They may or may not ward. Too many factors when I could just take Dragon. Wow, my Q cooldown is incredibly low. Oh, I'm dead. That sucks. <laughs> Would have been nice to have some help on Dragon. Their team wanted Dragon more than my team did. Imagine that. But hey, at least we got it. Even if I did have to lose my Dark Souls to get it. Nyla goes in. She dies. Ari has a bunch of R resets. Spam R. Can I do something top? Maybe. Lowry's still turbo tanking. It clits practically... A cannon minion at this point. <laughs> it's 58 CS, almost 15 minutes in. Maybe if I come up behind her. 437, she's four, 395. She's fast. She's getting phase speed up is what's going on. I'll take it. Don't forget to auto while you're using your Q. Helps out a lot with the speed. I do have my R. I want to invade Ramus. I'll R for this double R. Jump off on that side. I didn't quite get the pinch on him. I don't know if he dashed to me or dashed to Ramus, but. Kind of awkward. I can't get in what I want. Again with an E, auto Q, down he goes. I held on to W because I want to get out my other abilities first. I figured I didn't need W there as well.
Hit him with the EW. Got the pop on it. This is my auto. Down he goes. Here comes Alawi. Got it with my Q, double Q spam on my work ground. Nice. I didn't get what I wanted though. I missed what I needed to land. I ghosted for it. Nice. That's sick. Maybe he is uh, red buffs up. I'm hoping. Oh no, it's Nyla. Boop, got the bump. Going for the raw W is really freaking good if they're already CC. There's no need to get down E first if you know your W's gonna land. Oh, Ramus is on me. This is bad. Got the knockback on him. Got uh, my autos. I have to just run. They're all going to rotate to this. Ramus even has hollowed radiance and more magic resist, and we're still able to slice them up. That's awesome. We can set up work grounds if we think the enemies are going to come into the area. Just gotta keep them all up, and then as we kite away, we can just spam them out with our empowered Q since they're low cooldown. Kind of what we did against a lie earlier, but somewhat unintentionally. Alrighty. Nice. Got my R. All arm off this way. Oh, this is bad. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. Give me the R pop. Oh, I'm dead. Nyla. It's <laughs> so funny. Nyla's unironically killed me four out of five of my deads. She's always there for me. Get out of here, Nyla. You rotten turd. You fetid, reeking turd. <clears throat> Alright, got Robin on. I was going to go for Shadow Flame. I'm pretty fed as is. I don't think I really need it. I think I'm just going for Void Staff at this point. 19 Dark Harvest Stacks. You need Void Staff for their Ramus and uh, Lowey. In the mid game, just farm as much as you can. Don't die. I've done a really bad job of keeping my stacks up. With Talia's speed, she's one of the best Dark Seal mesh stacking junglers in the game. I think he's on his own here. Got the knockback. Nice, we'll take it. There's no one else really over here. Set up my work grounds just in case. Got it. Got it, got it, got it. Lowry's topside, I don't want to mess with her. Holy Harold here. Ooh, Ramis. QEW. Get the pop back. Oh, he's running. He's running, boy! Got him with that auto. <laughs> my auto is what killed him. That's so funny. Two or three of my kills against him have actually been an auto to finish it. Yeah, why don't you jump at me, buddy? Jump! That's what I thought. She can't jump through my E. She'll stun herself and take a lot of damage. Report Ramus for in. <laughs> this brand's insane. Oh, I got a big bull of nothing there. Thought I had a big bull of something. I even ghosted. Hmm, dang. I hit all of them with that Q. Lux hit a big R. <laughs> I can never run out of man. It's so dumb. But the, oh, I, I missed my knock. Dang it. 
Hey, Talia, why don't you sit on this? I got some pointy rocks for you. Your favorite. Or not Talia. What's her name? Nyla. Alright. Talia's running us down. We gotta smack this hoe with some rocks. Oh, she's getting low. She almost died there. That Luxar hit. Here comes Clad. Oh lord, he's coming. Three and seven. Get her the Enoch back. She flash panic flashes a bit. She's coming for me. I'm getting wrecked. That's so dumb. The amount of damage you take from her landing a single skill shot is wild. Yeah, nice try, buddy. Kinda need to heal back up. I could still help pill Ramus a bit. Do a little bit of peeling around here. Ooh, save me. Raw knocking back. I'm getting I don't even know what I'm getting hit by, but I'm getting hit by something that's perma slowing me. He must have spread his burn off of Kled onto me. Cause Brand was no Oh, they're in our base! They're gonna end! This is insane. They're actually ending. All right. I got void staff now. Oh man, this game's really close. We need drag soul. Drag soul will make it much easier for Ari, for Kaisa. Not really for me or Lux. I mean, Lux have to stand still to burn R. Well, I guess the rest of it. I think it gives you 20% movement speed all the time. 10 or 20%. And then you get a bunch when you use R. I have everything up. I don't want to overcommit. We don't need to go super deep in a fight to find a pick. We can let the enemies overextend. Because I have more damage than their back line. Clad needs a split push or something. He's being useless. He needs to push some lane. Is, is literally, it's like having a Yumi that doesn't press its buttons is what Kled's doing right now. I might have to match allow you on the split, which is kind of awkward. Okay, cool. Allow is grouping mid. That's good. Kled is just one of those champions where he, it's either kind of broken or does absolutely nothing. Not much in between. Oh, I might have pushed her out of that. Oh, I'm dead. Yeah, nice. I got absolutely zero peel. None. My whole team ran from me as Ramus engaged. That's unfortunate. Currently, we have more kills than our whole team combined. Not a single person pilled for us. Everyone chased while Ramus beat my head in. That's unfortunate. I'm, maybe I should just split push. That might actually be the best option. Because if we're going to team fight. And our team wants to. Wants to try to kind of out tank. The enemy tank. Then I don't know. It's just a tough fight. Or well, outside of that, or I need to hide behind my teammates. That also works. What do I have here? Oh yeah, I was going Shadow Flame. At some point, I had mesh stacks. Not anymore. We don't need to follow Kled. He is a cannon minion. We don't need to follow Kled. He is a cannon minion. We don't need to follow Kled, he's a cannon minion. It's very risky following him because it gives the illusion of having a teammate there. And I might die here. Thank goodness Brand's not focusing me. Oof. I don't have R. It keeps getting put on a cooldown.
That was a super forced random fight. Everyone on our team thinks they're the most fed person on the team and they want to just force a fight. Got her with the E, not bad. I'm going to have to R back for the her. I can't really engage on her. I just have to slow her down. She has Baron buff. They also got Dragon as well from that last fight when no one pilled Ramus. We need Lux to snare Ramus. Lux needs to hold that. Or position to where Ramus can't just run past her. Because realistically, Ramus he shouldn't be really allowed to just get the back line. This is a really random fight. I think we just killed Bra, maybe. I need to get my mana back. I can get Shadow Flame here. I'll be full build. 21 mana per second when in jungle. I'm full build way before. I guess not full build. I'm actually missing a full item still. Never mind. I kind of want Banshees. I know it sounds weird, but the Ramus Taunt or a random brand ability won't get me killed. Someone needs to get heal cut. I might have to get it. Probably me and Luck should both get it. Allow is healing a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. R is running straight into branch. She doesn't know it. We just have to push mid. Man, that stinks. They're definitely going to pinch us here. We're just kind of just stalling the game a bit. We have to reset. We all need to reset. We all need to reset or we will lose. Mm, I don't know if I can recall in time. Okay, cool. Ramus needed to try to stall my back. If we don't have heal cut for a lot, we're not going to be able to kill her. Kind of just wasted my ghost for that. Good thing I have Banshees. She got the soul pulse, so she's going to heal like crazy. Hey, Nyla. Goodbye, Nyla. Can we kill this nasty hoe? Oh, I didn't even press R on it. Holy crap. R is going to catch up eventually. Almost got it there. R needs to press freaking R, man. She's saving it for next game. I mean, where is she? I didn't even see her go. We're going to lose Dragon now. Holy crap. That stinks. Whatever. Killing a Lowey might actually be worth it. I don't think this game is going to last till Draxel. Lowey is kind of their whole team. Her and Bran are the only ones doing anything. This is a weird, weird fight to take. We might actually win it just since the Lowey is dead though. A reasonable response to everything. Well, Lau is dead. Well, Lau is dead. It is true. Lau is indeed dead. And you're not getting that cled. Nice. Oh, this is bad. Oh, I'm dead. I did get Braum at least, but our team needs to leave. This is a bad area now. Got wrecked by the uh, Ramus and behind Brand in the front. Nice. 
Gotta use those walls, line up the Q. Nice, that was a good Luxie. We gotta defend mid. We're gonna give up mid inhib to fight Ramus. Ari, Ari was gonna give up mid inhib to go fight Alawi. That's bold. Very bold. The bold and brave. I'm going Rylize. I'll sell boots at some point. Hmm. Still don't know how we don't have a hill cut on our team. I guess I. <laughs> I really don't want to have to build it, but I can. Double tap R, ride it out. Bro, her healing is insane. Holy crap. I almost died there and she barely touched me at any point. Oh no. Brand killed Lux. Lux outranges Bran. Unless Bran flashed there, Lux has to stay alive. This game's gonna come down to like long respawns. They're eating our base, but there more of them are dying for it. The only thing I have that's scaling is technically my Dark Harvest, but it's only scaling so much. I got Rise mainly just to kite out the Ramus, allow a Braum, stop their front line from getting so hard on me. I'll sell boots for uh, Cosmic at some point. Oh, they're on Baron. Hmm. Didn't even realize. Yeah, they got it too. Wow, I pretty much just one shot at Nyla. <laughs> we gotta walk this guy down. We'll knock him back. Oh, that damage is dirty. Someone hit this Ramus. Yes, Rylize. <laughs> she got a soul pull. This is dangerous. She's into my Rylize spam. We have to play it slow and not let her get a soul pull, though. She has so much tenacity. She got out of that Lux there in half a second. I'm just going to get off early. I'm not going to ride that wall in. <laughs> nah. Lowry's going to land a single skill shot and one tap me. You know how it is. Tank items. Not even tank items. but just a lie. Max health. Brand's going to try to splash something in. I can feel it. I got him with a Q. Bro, we could have broken that turret. People just hit it. Oh, there's a ward here. We got to back up. Ramus is going to have his speed in. Lau is breaking our base. Our teammates need to back. Our teammates need to back. Oh, he's actually just going for it. He smited off my thing, too. Oh, this is bad. Well, if Lux can kill Ramus, okay, she can't. If our teammates can kill Lowie, okay, Lux needs to stay alive if she can. Lowie's dead, our team can hold, the enemies will get dragon, but we haven't lost yet. I'm not even doing serious damage against Ramus here, it's crazy. Even with the Void Staff, Sork Shoes. We need another source of movement speed instead. That's what I'm thinking. You think cosmic would be the right item? Because it's kind of hard to sell these because they're they're faster than normal boots because they're free boots. Kill the minions quick! Nice. Well, the enemies almost have Draxel. <laughs> <clears throat> This is going to be a fun game once they have that. I'm not level 18 yet. 
<clears throat> Almost level 18. Got my elixir, full build, 800 AP, 37 Dark Harvest stacks. I wish Dark Harvest had better scaling than it does. I don't mind Clad still in my camps now because I'm already full build full items. All R for this. I'm on Ghost. Get the knockback. I have Ghost. We can Ghost these guys all the way in. I got to get out of that Soul Pull. I should have been able to Ghost that all the way in, but Allow is just Allow, man. That champion does so much. I'm gonna die. Oh yeah, I'm dead. Brand ate me alive. Nice Kaisa Kites. They just have to run. Alawi's Alawi. And Alawi has a lot of tenacity too right now. It's probably over 50%. Ooh, she has 15 slow percent. Lux just needs Robodon at this point. Robodon's gonna round off her build, give her a lot of damage. <laughs> Robodon her Void Staff, but ideally Robodon since she's full mesh. So sell support item for Robodon essentially. For me, I don't have a good item option. I mean, I could go Leandre's. Leandre's wouldn't be bad. Like Banshees is fantastic, but I'm at a point where I need their front line to die. They have a lot of MR, but not all of them. Brand's really squishy. Nyla as a whole is pretty squishy. Jeez, man, that took forever to get on that rock. I'm going to be patient. <laughs> Those Draxels are going to determine the game. If they get it for free, we might as well FF. Allow his bot side right now. It should be as simple as, simple as oh, I are bot. She dies, but allow is allow, you know. It's never that simple. If I are her, she could very well kill everyone. Very skillful character. That Brahm ability kind of hurts. And maybe we should take Baron. Alawi's on the TP. If we're going to take Baron, we'd have to do it really fast. It might just be worth the reset for Alawi, to be honest. I kind of want to reset for Alawi here, to be honest. Oh, Lux almost just died, lol. All R for this. The EQ. Get the knockback. Bro, I literally can't even keep up with Alawi right now. She's so fast. We can't stop Baron. At best, we can slow them without dying. At best. Or just Kaisa. Okay, alright. One for one. That's actually really good. Get down the EQ. They're perma slowed here. All right, Cled did something. We'll take it. Yeah, we all we all kind of had to base for Alawi. The type of character she is, she'll end if we only send two people and she kills them both. This guy has no clue what she's talking about. We hit the hit the turret. Hit the turret. Oh, if we could kill this guy, that'd be so good. We all have a high damage. We can literally just take the inhibit if people actually auto it. And now we get Dragon. Allow is coming. We got to do this quick. Oh, I'm going to die. Someone save me. 
We gotta kill Ramus. His teammates aren't here. We'll push him into my teammates. Oh. We all just have to kite back and away. Oh, Lowry's actually getting shredded. I am shocked. I think Lux's heel cut's doing all the work there. Maybe a little bit. <laughs> well, I was not tanky all of a sudden, man. She is just disappearing. Oh, this is bad. I can't press my buttons. They have a bunch of minions in our base. I mean, at least they didn't get dragon. We're about to lose that inhib, though. We need the casters dead. The casters first are the squishiest. They do the most damage. No, Ari, use your Q. We're at 44 Dark Harvest stacks. Both teams are at three dragons. Their team's a lot tankier than ours, but we have way more backline damage and it's stalling the game out on both sides. I think Ramus went for that. I think he's on our blue. Oh, he's not? Maybe he's on Scuttle then, because he went to that area. Yeah, oh jeez, he's fast. <laughs> Holy crap, he's got Kanic as well. They have two people mid. Ramus seems to be by himself. He might have... Okay, his teammates are c cutting in hard. I'm forced to keep my boots just because they're free boots, honestly. The extra 10 movement speed makes it hard not to keep it. I'm on Ghost and I feel like I'm not going to get anything out of it. There we go. Actually landing something now. Mm, trying to find something. Nice. Alright, we got Ramus. We'll R through. I don't know if my R helped my teammates there at all. I'd like to think that it did. Oh, she flashed. Cool. <laughs> I swear, Nyla always has flash. Oh, wow. I think we just lost. Crazy. No one could hurt Nyla there. Wild. Lux might be able to stall the game with R. To kill the minions. Because we, st we still have a base turret. Get an E down or something, my man. Nice. Game stalled. Drag's not up for a hot minute. I can't deal with Nyla. She just flash dashes to me every time. I, I, I have to stay in the back line and hit tanks. It was actually working that fight somewhat. Before I R'd. Now I've just done 2k. Just got to stick with what I got. Nothing else I could buy that would be better. We could focus on more movement speed. But. I don't know. I would have to sell off the Andres and Boy, I don't want to do that. Baron's the next objective. Oh, cool. I'm about to die. Brahm's here. We might be able to get to Brahm, maybe. Oh, no. We just have to reset. They're trying to end. They might be able to a little bit, especially if Kaisa walks into them. I'm just trying to reset that situation. I don't want my teammate dying to that. At least allow he can't reach this area, but Oh, this is bad. Oh, I need a shield, I need a shield. Oh my god. Couldn't even see that Alawi tentacle and they're trying to beat me too and I can't see him. 
I almost died. Drag's coming up. We gotta go to drag. We gotta go to drag. Nyla's not alive for a moment. We need vis forward vision with Lux ease and stuff. They're gonna, they could be bush camping. Yep. Alright, I guess let's try to get it. If Lux has a... Oh, this is bad. We got soul pull. Oh my gosh. She won't die. I think they're taking Draxel right now, honestly. Surprised they're not just taking Dragon. Nyla's on me again. I swear she's the person who kills me every time. Kaisa's doing the damage. That's huge. Man, I, I get so focused on whoever I'm trying to hit skill shots on, and then Nyla comes out of nowhere like Batman, punches me in the back of the head. We got the Drag Soul, though. Got some more Dark Harvest stacks. Hopefully, Lux has Gathering Storm. Oh, she doesn't. How's Brown Dan? I <laughs> have. He must have sold his boots and he can't afford the next item or something. What an absolute goober. Since it's skill shot teams, he'd probably be better off just holding on to tier 2 boots. Ari skill shots, Lux skill shots, Talia skill shots. I mean, heck, even Kaisa Rocket. Like, I, I have to hold on to boots. I can't do anything. I can't do anything by selling my boots. There's no AP item that gives me enough movement C. Not even Lich Bane's 8% is enough. I would need at least 15%. And there's nothing that really gives that. Because I don't just have tier 2 boots. I have fast tier 2 boots through free boots. I'll cut her off. Get her with the E, W. Dude, my soul, a lot, Kaisa is literally going to kill me here. She's running the brand and the Alawi soul pull into me. Holy crap. Kaisa actually almost just killed me in that fight. Oh, I'm dead. Well played to me. Completely lost track of Nyla again somehow. That's insane. We actually just lost... Unless Lux can kill Nyla somehow. I don't know if Ari's going to be alive in time. Maybe if their mid minions don't crash, they might have trouble breaking turret. That's so crazy, though. I, don't, I feel like their Nyla's played so poorly, but her champion's really strong late. We don't even have to ignore the Braum. Just kite back to us. We don't have to dive. That's an outrageous statement. We have a way bigger backline. We shouldn't just play let's all dive their backline as they dive our backline. That's ridiculous. It, it, it wouldn't work. I'm at 51 Dark Harvest stacks. It's been a long time since I've had that many Dark Harvest stacks. It's a very absurd game. I am happy we have Drag Soul though. It's kind of sick. I don't know who's where here. <laughs> what? Oh, Ramus is out of position, huh? So it's just whichever team's gonna throw first, I guess. My R is about to be up. I'm on Ghost. I can just run this guy down. Hmm. Is 
Nyla killing everyone over there. Imagine if I could kill Braum here. He almost got the spread to me on that. Oh my gosh. I threw, got him. <laughs> so dumb. I'm running out of HP too. <laughs> this game is so silly. I have to reset. We got to kill, clear these minions. We might be able to stop Alawi, to be honest. Uh, I don't know where she went. I guess she could have gone anywhere. She probably went for my red buff. I'm at 53 Dark Curvis stacks. How fun is that? Sell so mesh for Void Staff. Honestly... You can. Mesh for Void Staff wouldn't be bad. You could sell Morello if you feel like you don't need it. A lot is getting kited out pretty hard. That I don't know how much she's actually healing. Because we only have one melee champion. Oh no. Oh no. She's on my soul. I had to leave that fight. Kaisa literally just ran in 1v5 and tr Giga trolled. Unironically went in 1v5 and intentionally lost the game there. Got him. They're throwing really hard randomly. They all want to do something different because everyone wants to go to bed right now. The Kaiser randomly ints 1v5 for no reason. Then Brand does that. Makes a little bit of sense since I realized once I hit him, he's not really gonna be able to get away. But what is what is happening? They're just taking Baron slowly. I don't want to let these guys get Elder as well. I feel like we should get Elder since two of them are dead. Why can't we push out? I already have mid shoved. They're all coming for it. Oh, he's about to pop his crap on me. They're we're, they're actually going to be allowed to take this win. Oh no. Whatever. I'm going to go past these stupid tentacles. Got the knockback on Brom. We just need to keep kiting back. We gotta keep kiting back. Elias in base. Elias in our base. Kaisa should win that if she just autos. We need to kill this chick. She has to die. She missed the soul pull. She's nice. We can still get to Elder. She only got one inhib. We have two inhibs up. All right. Elder, they're on it. They're taking it kind of fast, but I think I can get there. Oh, no. This is bad. <laughs> he slowed. He slowed. Shield me. Shield me. Shield me. Please. No. Where's the shield go? Who got shielded there? Please tell me it wasn't Kled. Oh, my goodness. It was me? Wow, I don't even remember getting a shield there. <sighs> Nyla's alive. We gotta be careful. Nyla can one... Okay, never mind. She's mid. At least Nyla's the only person with Elder. They don't have multiple people. This game would be so much easier if we had just like a Scion top or something. To match their tank. But we just have Kled, who has... <laughs> who apparently built heart still last item because it only has 128 bonus health on it <laughs> oh my gosh he must have had that just for the last team fight he's trying to solo a giga fed nyla 
Luckily, his teammates are there to help. Nice, nice, nice. Braum is absurdly tanky. It would take me on my own, if Braum's standing still, probably 15 seconds to kill him. At, at least. It's really weird. Considering we have Tank Shred item, Void Staff Penetration, and Sort Pen. I can clear top, just group, just group. I, c I can move the map a lot quicker. I have more clear and I have more speed. Just stay grouped. I also have more escape potential, to be honest. Alright, I'm on my way. Just pill for Kaisa. Kaisa is the most important. Pill for Kaisa and kite back. That was bad. Kaisa actually went in on that. <clears throat> I'm on Ghost here, so I'm moving really, really quick. Got the Braum Flash. She missed Soul Pull. I feel like we can keep pushing this. They're low. Why is no one pushing with me? We can literally take their inhib for free. I have blue buff. I can perma spam. We have eld. We have a uh, soul. Oh, this is bad. Oh yeah, I get wrecked. Skank. This nasty hoe! She's so strong. Even just the eating my maxed out mage stuff. Gosh, I actually missed that attack. How did Ari get caught there? She's Ari. I'm dead. I need to kill this stupid Braum. That sucks. Braum's so low. She's not even gonna kill Braum. Well, she did kill Lowie. That's actually pretty good. Alright, well played, Kaisa. How did Kled not stay on Brand there? What happened? He was right on top of him. He's gonna yank him out of Q, hopefully. Pulls him out of that auto. Jeez, this game won't end, man. 59 minutes. <laughs> so stupid. We're gonna have over 200,000 damage dealt, at least. Such a long game. They're gonna have several hundred thousand mitigated on Ramus, Allow, and Braum. Everyone on the team just needs to take a sip of their gamer, their gamer supplements. Take a sip of water. If only there was an item that let me kill tanks as a magic damage character. That would be absolutely fantastic. It's really not though. I've already built it. We have 20% bonus movement speed from the soul just all the time. And these fights are still this close. Why are we Kled Aring over here? Why am I taking who why am I taking I'm gonna die, I need shield. Oh my god, what is happening? I don't even know what hit me. I couldn't see anything. I'm gonna die. I just happened again! Someone spread the brand E into me. That's literally what's killing me every time. It's like random brand E getting spread off a clet or something as he dashes back. I can't even see it. I can't get away from it. 
Kled and Arya are literally killing me when nothing would be able to normally get to me. My teammates are low too. They're not going to take drag. That's probably GG's. Oh. That's insane. That's such a silly mechanic that I, that won them that. Because if we literally just play backline instead of engaging, that can't happen. My Leandres is done. 11,000 damage. I don't really want to sell it for Banshees. I don't know what to do. If I play backline like I'm supposed to, I'll die from Brand E spread. And if I play frontline, obviously I'm going to die because I'm playing frontline when we have a Kled tank versus a Lowy Ramus Braum tank. Feels. Feels bad. They have Elder here too. And Baron. When you're full build and the minion's so tanky, it takes you several ability cycles to kill it. I'm coming. Lowry's might die here. No. Oh, they're on our base. Shoot. Yeah, it's just game over. They're going to hit the base. Yeah, that's GG's. I had fun, even if it's a loss. We'll look at damage dealt, damage taken, and runes. Looking at damage dealt against enemy champions, we had the most in the game by a decent amount. Actually, quite a bit, honestly. Not bad. Brian had the most on his team. Uh, Braum and Ramus were pretty low. Four damage taken. Yeah, they took around 130,000 each. Kled took quite a bit himself. Self-mitigated. This is what separates their tanks from our tank. Is they self-mitigated twice as much as him. And Ram is self-mitigated almost three times as much. Probably self-mitigated a lot as well. And for runes, high value. All in all, Tulia Jungle is a monster jungler. But at the end of the day, you can only do so much to carry. If you guys enjoyed this Tulia Jungle video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And let me know what champion you want to see next. My name is Kingsticks. Thank you for watching. And I'll catch you guys next time.